I make the shitty videos so you don't have to. Gotta cut this out. And remember, crazy dumb sick. That small YouTuber. Does churches pay property taxes on the house they own? The preacher does. Do they pay taxes on the house that they own? You know, because I own my home. I was wondering. You know, I have to pay taxes on my home. So, do they have to pay taxes on their home? By looking up, and I came across this article. An article says, homes owned by churches avoid thousands in property taxes. A local 10 investigation found pastors living in multi-million dollar homes exempted from paying property taxes because their homes are owned by churches, but neighbors say they don't see large congregations at either home. I say that right? I don't know. A 12,000 square foot home in Colorado Springs that has a pool, guest house, and several garages was recently assessed at a 1.9 million. Records show the previous owner, a former Miami Dolphin, paid 50,000 a year in property tax, but the current owner pays nothing. A 5,000 square foot house on the New River is worth 2 million, but the man who lived there, Sonny, Irons, I don't know if I'm saying that right, hasn't paid property tax in years. Why? Both homes are owned by churches. The, the link will be in the description to show the, if you want to read the rest of the article. So churches get away with not paying thousands of dollars in taxes. So the preacher don't have to pay taxes on the house. One of the things that should happen in this country is churches should have to pay taxes and they get away with 71 billion dollars here's a guy to tell you it's better than i can here he is a 2015 study showed that churches are costing taxpayers billions so let's let Jesus foot the bill, right? He's, you know, look, you know he's rolling in it. You do. He never spends a dime, sleeps in a manger. He's getting drunk off of water. What a fucking affordable life that guy has. So he also has a good point about um, churches not uh, donating to people, but instead just hold on to all that money. He has two examples. Here they are. But actually, the Mormon church, for example, spends roughly 0.7% of its income on charity. Here's another uh, more standard example. The United Methodist Church has an average of 71% of revenues going to operating expenses, while help to the poor is somewhere within the remaining 29%. It's crazy how much the church gets away with stuff, you know. Like you, you'll see the preacher and he'll be driving his, his car and he's got a Mercedes Benz in his, in his, in his uh, garage, you know. Or you sitting there scraping by, giving you 10% every week because, you know, that's what God asked. And the preacher just takes your money and then in the end of the, the, the week, he counts his money, you know. And, uh, this preacher never gives away anything, but maybe a, a small fraction of what he gets every week. A small fraction. You can't. It's it's so small that if you if you looked at the books, you'd be like, "Where's all this money going to?" But when a preacher's got a, a private plane. And a television show with, with a lot of lies to fool people. It's a problem. And I don't like that. It's a business. That's how people should look at it. It's a business. Take your hard earned money so one person can live in luxury and, and not worry about losing their house. Now, every American wish they could do that, not worry about having to lose their house because they ran out of money 
that month or year or month, you know, week. Didn't didn't pay that mortgage, didn't pay the taxes that year. And it's a shame, you know. Um I believe that every American should pay taxes. How would you feel if if you lost your home because of taxes? In the year, you went in foreclosure because of taxes. Because you couldn't pay. Did you know that preachers, if they don't pay their taxes, they get to keep their house? So even if they do a bad job at preaching, People don't like them or anything. They can keep their house. Even if they're doing a bad job in the community, they're exempt from taxes. They get to keep their home. How does that make you feel? Raise your dumb sick out. Oh.